Navigating to a screen rarely seen. Extra tiff. If Bro One could uh, convert his like, sorry, are we still on Bro One? Okay, yeah. Go I just on. think if Bro One could convert like, because he's like really, we were just saying he's really good at picking his timing, his options. Yep. If he could convert that into like Riz, he'd be like a like a Sigma male. He'd be like the goat of picking you his moment. suck. But like, he none of those drive. words are in the Bible. Actually, <laughs> what have you just said? <laughs> now they're not. You'd be in, epic swag. They're not in the Bible. They're in uh, my Bible. The Book of Dan. The Book of Dan. Jeez. Oh, because it's your podcast, Esports, Nick McKenzie, aka Extra. This is this a tough is our one. Boy. This is a tough one for us because, yes, Extra is our sponsor. sponsored by us, our player, but also Luma is a the, day one road dog homie. You the know? hometown hero. Yes. So. This almost feels like a like team kill, regardless, you know. But yeah, this for us specifically. For, for, us, though, for us specifically, yeah. this is like a team kill right now. Yeah. Bro one is on the phone in the background. He's probably telling Bro two about his great victory that was shared on the Big Cheese Four stage. I'm happy for him. Dura um did make a prediction that Bro one's going to go huge this tournament. Entering in is that was that Winner's that, side? That, 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 was that, that was from our podcast. Dura did. Did feel like Bro One was going to perform. What's crazy, yeah, is underperforming top all eight week into winner side top eight for Bro One. Into winning the tournament. We are going to see another wolf though. Hopefully, this wolf performing a little bit better than the uh, previous wolf. But we've got me, Brawler, a very fast paced matchup. I don't remember the last two times these people were played personally. But, but they're all leg they're legacy players, you know what I mean? Yes. They're used to the big stage. Yep. I think it's something you notice a lot at majors that the people that do send to make it far are the legacy players. Yeah. They've got specific things that like external factors that aren't a part of the game like stamina, calm nerves, things that you can't get unless you make it here, right? Yeah. Whereas, you know, a mid-level player trying to grind, how can you grind you, you tournament need, nerves? You know, yeah, exactly. you have to just keep playing. You just need to battle it in the fire, you know what I mean? Get used Absolutely. to it. Absolutely. Oh, the Tomahawk f till coming from And these from two players. Oh, rough SD from extra. You had the lead and you've thrown it away. Could also, even use up real quick if he yes. gets... Clearly looking for a back throw or dash attack. Finds neither. Maybe an up tilt. Maybe a wolf up tilt to close it out. Can you get over this up Oh and my god, I up hate... No, 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 no. Shut no. up, fun. Did that was some extra about room. that? I don't need to tell him how to play his character. <laughs> oh, Tiff going for the money shot right there. What did you just say? The money shot. When no, don't repeat it. <laughs> the F smash to close it all <laughs> out. <gasps> okay. The suicide kill. All right. Both players stoic. Yeah, both players going, all right. As if that didn't just happen. The Nair's in. That, that, the Me Brawler in there, it, both these characters actually, but specifically Me Brawler, has like a, a kitchen sink for a net. It does yeah. everything for you. Yeah. Disadvantage, advantage. You're a bit bored, press the Nair button. You're not sure what to do, press the Nair button. Ledge trapping, edge guarding. Pots, pans, dishes, you name it. It does everything. Watch Nair do something. Are we going to wait till Nair does something? Oh. We might be waiting till game two because this is looking like it's going to close out soon. Not quite. Oh, holding down extra. He held down last Choosing time. Choosing the wrong option. But Tiff, not committing enough. A lot of flashing back punches coming out. Yes. Looking like a Dragon Ball Z. <gasps> okay. Yeah, the back end. Crowd erupting. Once again, looks very dead from the player cam's perspective. Trust me, viewers. There is a thriving crowd here. There is a crowd sport. there, and they're all having a good time. They're just slightly off camera. Trust LJ Esports <laughs> Source, crew. trust me, bro. <laughs> <laughs> the LJ Esports crew coming in large to support their yes. gal. And obviously, we're supporting Nick from the sideline as commentators. I love the fact that Nick is committed to having the bucket hat on with headphones. Actually, yeah, I wasn't even strong enough to do that. Might be hindering uh, his gameplay. I'm not saying he's playing bad at all. I'm just saying, might have SD'd because he couldn't see how far away he was. No. 
end of the day, the he looks good. He's playing good. I feel good about extra. If Luma wins this, by the way, yep. this will be the f her first major she's top hated post COVID. Very true. Yes. So this is a big one. This does for her. mean a lot. Yes. But also, she's not playing like there's a lot of pressure, right? Seems cool, calm, and collected yes. right now. Call her a cucumber. He's definitely not panicky. Like, I think the thing that clearly yeah. tells when someone's panicking, oh. it's just like someone's use of buttons. I think yes. when people are spamming buttons, like every opportunity they get, it's like, man, you're nervous. Yeah. It's like when you, like, talk a bunch, when you're nervous to, like, cover up that you're nervous. And it's like, yeah. you're, you're nervous. Just relax. You can see that sort of vibe in the gameplay. Like, yeah. But, but right now, both players pretty comfortable up here. Extra, however. Comfortably in the lead. Right? Yeah. And yeah. in an uncomfortable spot, you might say, on ledge. But imagine you get no. out of there. We make it look easy. Um, tier free setting, though. Could be another opportunity. There's a flashing map punch. Finds her way in. She was for it last game a lot. And that's the first time it's come come out well. When it's that telegraphed, you know, you've got to you got to go for those. And I think yeah. Tiff always ready on the trigger. I think she has been a bit over-eager the past two games, so hopefully she can find her footing for those flashing Mac punches. I mean, we say ledge. that, but she's up 1-0, right? She is, yeah, but she didn't find a lot of opportunities last time and reversed herself. This is the thing about a road dog. You can be... I understand that you're... You're not being overly critical. You're just being real. Just like... I'm impressed by your gameplay, Tiff. I know you can do better. Hey, that's that's what we do as um, Christmas Chef Podcast Esports. We keep it real. Yeah, we absolutely. We always keep it real. Um, something I do admire about Nick's gameplay, I just want to talk about. I was playing with friends before. Yeah, go on. And, like, usually, boom, up to taking another Dude, I'm stuff. I'm so upset. Um, he could have just up and out of shield. Why did he drop shield up to? You've definitely told him something. It. Anyways, but, we're talking about his gameplay. He will pick a defensive option, and like a lot of people like pick the noob defensive options, you know, like a spot dodge or a shield. Yeah. But like he picks like slight drift away. <laughs> he it's like a it's like stronger defensive options, you know what I mean? Oh, but maybe you should have air dodged there, flashing Mac punch. And it's like landing. the difference between these top players, you know? Yeah. It's like small, but it makes such a difference. Yeah. Extra feels like a very cerebral player, right? Yeah, like he, like like you were spot on. Like instead of spot on, you could do like a drift away there, and it's like, wait, he's using a hitbox while drifting away. It's like, actually, what do I do? <laughs> like that's insane. A actually. wolf hitbox while drifting away? Yeah. Good luck trying to punish drift away wolf now. Are you he's like a me? paper plane. He's just going as far. As, like he just goes the distance. And extra trying to go the distance. Speaking right of going the distance, now. extra reads that with a down smash, but doesn't quite connect. Wow, going okay. through the stage, just sort of shifting layers. We've like, got two we're doing whatever stage we want reverse now, right? flashing Mac punches. Can we get a third from Tiff? I don't know. We'll have to wait and see. How about a third up till coming out from Wolf? Um, extra, yeah, I'm extra sick of you mentioning this up tilt, mate. I swear it's just all right. Oh, speaking of all right. And extra putting on extra damage to sort of get Tiff in a more killable range. Oh, holding, holding down. down. Go for the Hail Mary. Fuck it. We ball. <laughs> <laughs> That's a fair read, though, because obviously, as Brawler Tip has been landing on stage quite a lot. Yes. Bit over eager, though, going for a read that's not really there and just kind of guessing. It's so dangerous to be on the ledge against Wolf, so I understand why you're like keen to skip yeah. ledge trapping as like a phase of a game. You Might just as get well. right back into the action. This is definitely up tilt range, by the way. One unsafe <laughs> move, and that up tilt is coming out. But also, if Brawler lands an up tilt on the, underneath the plat, could be an up air, up air, up air. Dash attack, oh my god. Boot to the face, nearly oh. pulling it off. Calling out the stall off from Tiff. <gasps> oh. Uh oh. Crowd losing their minds on that one. Connor screaming his that head off. That could have been the reversal Tiff needed. That That's back it. throw range, potentially. Yep. Wow. I can't believe both of us went, maybe it is Super immediately quick. died. Yeah. Instantly shot off the screen. Unbelievable. 1-1 one, one for these gamers. Absolutely. Teed up for an alright set, huh? Like I mentioned previously, gone for <laughs> What? Nothing. Okay. Look, like I said previously, this is Tiff's oh. um, top eight potential, potential set debut, before getting right? into top, top eight debut. Yeah, potentially. So game one... Let's not get ahead of ourselves. I was going to say, game one... Like John Bombo got ahead of himself last night, saying, I'm going to win Big Cheese 4 and then get it. Bowing out at like 30 cents. Drinking four bottles of soju into 
Extreme Hangover into 17th place. Oh, Game and Watch Switch. Oh, here we go. <coughs> the win into the Switch, actually. True yes. Combo. But I'm the saying, counterpick war starts. Mate. We could see a potential rattle from Tiff if, like, you can see the finish line. You know what I mean? If, yeah. She's going to hold her mental strong. Yeah. And Absolutely. Game and Watch is just the right character to put that pressure on the mental. This character is so obnoxious and it has just some real bullshit just oh. like that. that Not you're killing. Gonna be you're alright, you're alright. Not killing. Mate, Tiff she loved was that at one 60 percent It did kill Spark though. It nearly killed. That was yeah. pretty good DI for Pretty Tiff. cooked, yeah. Speaking, Speaking of cooked. Of cooked. Oh, oh, hello Daniel. Hello, Chef, actually, at the ledge, not you, my good friend. Oh, okay. Chef at ledge, it's literally turn your brain off, ledge trap. Yep. So good your mum could do it. There you go, Tiff, trying to skip ledge trapping once again. Recognising Chef's pretty good. I don't want to have to deal with that one. Oh, pulling out a high up B. Can we get a second one? All right, 74% now. This is no kill jump range on extra. for watch. Extra dangerous. All right, can we make a pact to stop making, like, extra puns? You made two, and I made one. Yeah. That was kind I of didn't realize you would keep it. Tally, mate. Oh! That's dead, actually. No. Nah, it's not at all. Sorry, I gave Flashing Mac Punch too much credit there. Oh, that is, though. Get up, F2. Share to the face. That move is faster than the speed of sound. Hold up. That is no jump on Tiff right now. That is a nasty spot. Good roll in, but both shielding. Extra finding the better of that scramble. Bang. Yeah, I gotta yeah, say, yeah, yeah. Um, do you think Tiff prefers Brawler Game & Watch or Palu Game & Watch? Well, I don't know, because um, well, Hulda Extra won the last match, which meant it was Tiff's counterpick, so she's decided to say Brawler for Game & Watch. Right, okay, yeah. I was thinking that. I was thinking she does prefer Brawler into uh, Game & Watch, because uh, for those of you who don't know, Jordan Ridley Poppet won uh, Game & Watch main. Still comes to a tournament or two, so Tiff definitely... Warmed up for this matchup. Has the experience. Maybe not the player matchup, though. I've heard they're very different players. They are. When I was playing extra earlier today. Oh, there we go. Rough DI. Beautiful conversion coming in from Luma there. And at such a crucial percent as well. Like, extra was still, like, mid-percent. Yeah. And she's creeping up to death percent there. Really brought her back into this game and winning it. Bomb straight to the face. What were you saying about... um? different players. You extra, extra and Poppet definitely today. are different styles of plays. Yep. I can't talk about Super analytically, but I can tell you right now that she's got the character experience, but not the player one. Right. Well, possibly the player one, right? How, how much history is there with these players? They're both I'm seasoned honestly bets. not too sure. I can't remember the last we time. We suck at this, man. None That's of us like, good, know what's going on. We're just sort of going through the motions. <laughs> Holding strong there, not letting it rip. Bite yeah. blade style. Speaking of going through the motions, extra. Throwing out a few nares. Up He's bees out of his down smashes. Yeah. Yes, you are so one. correct. Stop hammer time. Extra says, oh, as he lands. And he's done a 180 on the smash. He's gone from down straight down to up. up. He knew what he was looking for. He knew the percent range. He, he, he striked, my friend. Call him Arnold Schwarzenegger. The way he be going down. Up, down, up. Do you know what I'm? <laughs> yes. Quite. I, it, I was worried because it was a little bit niche. That like, you might not get that, and I just have to keep saying down, up, till you say, yeah, man. You know what? Me out. I will tell you right now. It was funny, and then you went, yeah, you know where that's from, man. <laughs> it's you know what I mean? Me, it's he took me out the joke. Sorry. But um, we'll see if Tiff's been taken out of the game. Going on into game four. Two one is the current score. Going back to the wolf. Can I just say? Did he just click game and watch? Can I just say? Gravity is a prophet in chat. Watch him say I'm swapping back to Wolf. <laughs> oh, stop it, man! Stop it! Are you serious? He's had a dream or something, man. He's a prophecy. He's a prophet. Can I get your predictions for uh, like results? Oh, Gravity, Gravity why are you there, mate? What's the lotto numbers going to yeah. be next week? <laughs> Help a brother out. All right, same stage. A lot of these sets have boiled down to, let's just pick the same stage over and over again. These players, they figured out the uh, stage Ooh, meta. F-Smash not quite hitting. He had the right idea, just not the timing. Here we go. Oh, barely missing that. I can hear Kali's screeches every time an up air hits. It's on a that very button. distinctive scream, right? Yeah, it's loud and annoying. <laughs> <laughs> Must be Connor. Wow. Quickly getting flashbacks to that fly on his face yesterday. Hold up, that up smash Loud like, and annoying. That up smash looks like Jalare just scooping up Luma there. 
bread. For those of you who don't know, uh, Jalari is a <laughs> is that ice not cream Oswai? shop. I don't know, man. They're in that basket and rubbers. <laughs> <laughs> That extra take this first look. Now he's stuck on ledge. Yeah. Not out of the woods yet. All right, now it finds his way. Yeah. A little Not bit extra credit. Here we go. Oh, read the. Oh. oh. Mate, this is the reading corner because extra is getting a few good reads in. I feel like extra would have loved silent reading time as a kid. The flashing back punch. Definitely not on like Where's Wally. Definitely oh on like. Oh my goodness gracious. Definitely on like Percy Jackson. You know, <laughs> as like a six-year-old kid. Oh, dude. Extra, extra not killing. Extra has like dialed in. Tiff laughing it off. Extra's like dialed in. He's getting the reads. He's just not getting the timing. That is no jump. Oh, and Ned. Once again, doing everything you need it to. The difference in player right now. Tiff showing a bit of emotion when things don't quite go her way, but laughing it off. Extra cool. Calm. He loves it. Tiff loves the stage, and Extra is just like. He's just playing the game. Oh my gosh. Wow. wow. This is actually silent reading time. I don't think that's the difference between everybody. It's like, yeah, like, we're having a laugh, but, like, we're here to fuck around, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. I'm not laughing at enough smash killed me. <laughs> not fucking Personally, fun. I'm trying to get winner's side top eight for I love the first a joke. time. I love a joke. Where's it's the COVID. joke? Where's the joke? <laughs> Where's the joke? You know what's a joke? Oh, no. Don't. <laughs> Whoa, that could have been nasty for Tiff on the hand. You go, oh, why didn't they just finish the game right there, mate? <gasps> Speaking of finishing, oh, oh Tiff can't finish her food. He did up B. Instead of the side oh. be mixing up the timing, they're throwing Tiff yeah. off her game. Ooh, extra looking like he's sitting in the driver's seat and Luma is his passenger oh. princess. <laughs> Finally hitting one of these F smashes. Looking dire for the LJE crew right now. Because it's your podcast esports, it will be up though. Stocks have never been higher. I tell you. Best team in WA having to outsource When we say we players. back the right horse, you got to trust it, man. On race day, come come find us. Oh, oh stop it, mate. Actually, the fakest kill screen of all time. Oh. The back air hitting the flashing mat punch. Extra. Space. Moving on to the top eight winner side, Tiff. Not being able to do it. No. She still has a chance in losers. Absolutely. But her top eight dreams have slipped away just not a touch. Quite. No, not just quite. a touch. Not quite. She went, from two, she went from two hand grip to one. So she went. Like two, two hands on the ledge. She went like, from two oh. hand grip yeah. to one. What are you doing? <laughs> what are you doing? Don't want too many hard solos. What are you doing, man? You always do this. 